you're going to have to get that poonski today, right? I mean, so you don't have to worry about getting out there in some of that treacherous weather yesterday, treacherous travel. You don't tomorrow. want to have to battle that as the day progresses, especially tonight into tomorrow. We've got light snow that's falling now. Guys, first alert day, and this is going to be quite the wintry wallop that's going to hit the area. Uh, fifth third bank camera. First round of light snow that's happening now is occurring at 14 degrees. A very fluffy light snow with a northerly wind at 8 miles per hour puts our wind chill at 3. So again, this is batch number 1. Light and fluffy snow that's going to be expected and I think all totaled is one to three inches that will occur early today with the heaviest still yet to fall tonight. Some sub zero wind chills showing up across southern Michigan. Single digit readings across all of northern Ohio and we are officially under a winter storm warning in all of Ohio. Generally speaking, that's for six to 12 inches, but I'll show you some areas that I think that could top out over one foot of snow. I'll tell you first time in my history I've ever seen this a winter storm warning that is in effect from the southern tip of Texas all the way across the deep south into the Ohio River Valley and off into New England through Maine. That is over 2,000 miles of a winter storm warning that is absolutely going to be incredible for the amount of snow this one is going to be producing. They're getting clobbered with snow down across East Texas all the way down into Houston where they've got heavy snow falling. Very unusual for them to get that snow, and this snow is going to work right up the Mississippi River Valley. Two rounds of it. Round number one that we're experiencing now. Round number two. Here it is, this piece of energy that is going to clobber us tonight with some heavy snow that will be expected. So first round that I just showed you, it's fairly light. It just gets us prepared. One to three inches will be expected. Heavier snow tonight that will arrive, especially after about four o'clock into the evening. Six to ten inches of snow expected tonight into tomorrow morning. And I expect some blowing and drifting of this really light and fluffy snow could exceed, especially in rural areas, two to three feet for the snow drifts. It's easy to say travel by tomorrow morning could be extremely hazardous, if not impossible in some rural areas. So there's the first batch of light snow comes through. We get a little lull into the afternoon, so mid afternoon don't be thinking, well, where's the snow? It is coming tonight. The heavier snow that will come it comes in after four o'clock. Heavier snow begins. Major travel hazards will develop tonight as we get clobbered with the heaviest of the snow. As we go through midnight, we may be getting snowfall rates that could exceed one inch per hour for several hours, which means it piles up very quickly. You get the driveway done tonight. You wake up tomorrow morning right back full again with snow should be done by daybreak, but still blowing and drifting of that snow. Widespread accumulations. Pay close attention. Six to 12 inches will be expected. Maybe an area though east of Toledo, a decent amount of our area that goes toward 10 to 14 inches of total snow. That includes what's falling this morning through tonight and through tomorrow. Some of the heaviest of the snow may line up just east of I-75. So we'll get round one, one of light snow today flurries into the afternoon and the heavier stuff arrives this evening and tonight. Some of that blowing snow will create hazardous to impossible travel in rural areas. Instead of 10 day forecast, we've got the first winter storm to deal with tonight into tomorrow. We'll take a break Wednesday, but right back toward what looks to be another winter storm on Thursday. And that one too could bring significant accumulations as we go through Thursday night and into Friday morning.